we have entered a turning point. 3i, Atlas, the bizarre interstellar visitor, is no longer just a faint whisper in the deep. It is finally beginning to show its true nature. This object, racing in from beyond the stars, has now closed to within about 185 million miles of the Sun. That's already inside the orbit of Mars, and every mile it travels inward, it becomes stranger, brighter, and more unpredictable. 3i Atlas is flying at a jaw-dropping 135,000 miles per hour. At that speed, it could cross the continental United States in under two minutes. But speed is just one part of the story. What has astronomers on edge is how fast it is transforming. Instead of remaining a dim, icy rock, its core is exploding outward, producing a gigantic bubble of dusty plasma, a coma so large that some estimates suggest it rivals half the diameter of the Sun. And its glow? Already around 12th magnitude and rising far quicker than predictions ever allowed. If this brightening trend continues, by the time it slingshots around the Sun later this fall, it could be one of the brightest and most dynamic interstellar events humanity has ever witnessed. But there's more. The object is behaving in ways that break the rules. Instead of a graceful tail stretching away from the Sun, 3i Atlas has developed something far stranger, a sunward-pointing anti-tail. Imagine a plume of dust and plasma streaming directly into the solar furnace. That shouldn't be possible. No normal comet does this. Some experts argue it's an electromagnetic trick. Charged dust grains being whipped around by the solar wind in directions we don't fully understand. Others believe the nucleus is cracking apart, venting exotic ices that have never before been exposed to sunlight. And still others whisper, maybe it isn't a comet at all. To grasp how unusual this is, let's compare. We've only seen two confirmed interstellar objects before. Oumuamua, 2017. A cigar-shaped enigma, no tail, no coma, yet it accelerated as if pushed by invisible hands. 2i Borisov 2019, closer to a normal comet but still chemically odd. And now 3i Atlas, faster than both, brighter than both, and far stranger in its activity. A plasma bubble in the wrong direction, a brightness curve that refuses to follow the math. By every measure, it is the weirdest of the three. Recent telescope images reveal an eerie green glow. Normally, this color comes from molecules of diatomic carbon, C2, fluorescing in sunlight. But early readings of 3i Atlas suggested it didn't contain much of this chemical at all. So where is the glow coming from? Has the sun's radiation unlocked hidden layers of exotic ice that have been trapped for perhaps a billion years of interstellar travel? Or is the chemistry of the object itself actively changing as it interacts with our star's energy? It feels less like an inert rock and more like something alive. And now the speculation begins to boil over. Some astronomers quietly wonder if it could be a fragment of a shattered alien planet flung into space and carried for unimaginable distances until now. Others imagine its plasma bubble acting like a cosmic antenna, coupling with the sun's electromagnetic field in ways that might even produce signals. And yes, the boldest voices suggest it could be some form of engineered probe wrapped in dust revealing itself only as it nears its destination. What is certain is this, 3i Atlas is not normal. The countdown has begun. In the coming weeks, it will brush past Mars, vanish into the glare of the sun, and then swing around for its closest approach. Each stage is a trigger. Each stage could bring a spectacle or a catastrophe. And here's the thought that chills me. When it disappears behind the sun, we will have no eyes on it. It will vanish into the fire, and when it emerges, it may not be the same object at all. This is only the beginning. In part two, we'll explore the possibilities. Sudden breakups, plasma storms, maybe even a glow so bright it challenges the planets themselves. This is Starlight Mysteries, and the story of 3i Atlas has only just started to unfold. What happens next with 3i Atlas may defy everything we thought we knew about interstellar visitors. This is not just another comet drifting through space on a frozen journey. This is something stranger and its next moves could shake astronomy to its core. The first major test comes as 3i Atlas brushes past Mars. At its closest, it will be just over 23 million miles from the red planet, a stone's throw in cosmic terms. Imagine it. Robotic orbiters circling Mars, rovers crawling across its dusty surface, all turning their instruments toward this bizarre object. We may finally learn the size of its nucleus. 
Some estimates suggest it could be a few miles wide. Others whisper it could be a fractured cluster of smaller bodies, a swarm masquerading as one. If even a single fragment broke free and plunged into Mars, it could release energy equal to thousands of nuclear weapons. While that outcome is unlikely, the fact that it's even in the realm of possibility has scientists nervous. But after Mars comes the blackout. 3 i Atlas will slip behind the sun from Earth's view. For several days, no telescope, no probe near Earth will see it. It will be cloaked in solar glare. And this is where imagination runs wild. Will it disintegrate in silence, torn apart by solar heat? Will it flare up like a green torch, its plasma bubble expanding until it rivals the sun itself? Or will it survive intact, slingshotting back into the galaxy as a messenger of unknown origin? What chills me most is this. We won't know until it re-emerges. We are forced to wait, blind, as the most mysterious object of our time hides behind the star that gives us life. At its closest approach, 3i Atlas will be just over 90 million miles from the sun. Its velocity will surge to nearly 152,000 miles per hour. At that speed, the sun's gravity could tear it apart in an instant. If it survives, though, it will erupt with activity. Exotic ices, ammonia, methane, maybe even compounds we've never detected before, will vaporize in a furious storm. The coma could expand to tens of millions of miles across. And if its brightening trend continues, it might even edge into naked eye visibility. Picture it, a green, ghostly star glowing near the sun, visible even without a telescope. That is not fantasy. That is a possibility. Let's not forget its most unnerving feature, the anti-tail. Dust and plasma flowing directly toward the sun instead of away from it. This could be evidence of electromagnetic forces at work on a scale we do not understand. Charged particles trapped in invisible magnetic fields, bending physics into patterns that look almost designed. Some plasma physicists suggest that dusty plasmas, the very stuff swirling around 3i Atlas, can self-organize, behaving like a living system. In the lab, these structures twist, form waves, even mimic cellular behavior. Could this interstellar traveler be carrying with it not just material from another star system, but processes that border on the living? And then there's that strange green glow. If this light continues to intensify, it may act as a beacon in the night sky. Historically, comets glowing green were seen as omens, celestial messengers. Imagine the awe or the fear when people around the world suddenly see a green torch hanging in the heavens. The scientific explanation may be carbon molecules or chemical changes under solar radiation. But the emotional impact, the sheer shock of a world suddenly seeing a strange green star, cannot be overstated. Speculation is running ahead of data. Some astronomers quietly wonder if it could be a fragment of a shattered alien planet, flung into space and carried for unimaginable distances until now. Others imagine its plasma bubble acting like a cosmic antenna, coupling with the sun's electromagnetic field in ways that might even produce signals. And yes, the boldest voices suggest it could be some form of engineered probe wrapped in dust, revealing itself only as it nears its destination. What if it is responding to our sun? What if its entire journey has been leading to this moment? An interaction with our star, an exchange of energy and information on a cosmic scale. Once perihelion is complete, 3i Atlas will either rocket back out of the solar system or shatter into fragments. If it survives, its trajectory could take it past Jupiter next year. And that could spark an entirely new chapter, an interstellar body interacting with the largest planet in our system and its powerful magnetic field. Imagine what could happen if 3i Atlas collides with one of Jupiter's moons or disturbs its radiation belts. That's not science fiction, that's orbital mechanics. 3i Atlas is only the third interstellar object we have ever seen. The first was confusing. The second was strange. But this one, this one feels like a messenger. Its speed, its glow, its anomalies, all screaming that something is different. We may never know exactly what it is. But one thing is certain. This object is rewriting the rules in real time. And we are the generation that gets to witness it. This is why we watch the skies. This is why Starlight Mysteries exists. 
because every so often the universe sends us a riddle. And if we pay attention, if we stay curious, we get to be part of the answer. So I ask you, friends, if this story moves you, if you feel that same rush of wonder and urgency that I do, please support the channel. Hit like, share this with someone who loves cosmic mysteries, and subscribe so you don't miss the next update. Most importantly, drop a comment below. Tell me where in the world you're watching from. Let's build a map of curiosity, a community of stargazers bound together under the same mysterious sky. The countdown has begun. Three Eye Atlas is revealing itself, and the real story may be stranger than anything we've ever imagined.